Hi there. I'm Lawrence Schwedler. I'm the program director of DigiPen's music and sound design programs. My background is an audio director for the video game industry for about the past 20 years. The last 12 of that was at Nintendo Software Technology where I had the privilege of working on such iconic games, if you will, of Wave Race Blue Storm, 1080 Avalanche, Metroid Prime Hunters, and Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Uh, definitely the coolest job in the world. In 2012, I left Nintendo to come to DigiPen to oversee two degree programs. One is the Bachelor of Arts in Music and Sound Design, and that's a four-year program for composers and musicians like myself who want to learn to write music, produce sound, record voices for video game and animation. The other degree program is the Bachelor of Science in Computer Science and Digital Audio, and that's a program for programmers, people who are going to write code to make the audio work in these complex video games that we've come to expect from the industry. Recently, I had the opportunity to work with a student game team on a game called Quasar League, which is a MOBA, a multiplayer online battle arena. We very quickly decided uh, that a science fiction angle would be appropriate for this, and so that's what we uh, went to do. Uh, let me show you how we uh, get started on a project like that. Okay, this is Logic Pro. It's the big brother of GarageBand. These are digital audio workstations for the Mac. If you have a Windows PC, you've got uh, programs like FL Studio, Sonar, Mixcraft, and a bunch of others. Uh, they're all similar in that they allow you to record microphones, uh, direct instruments like guitars and bass, electric guitars and basses, or virtual instruments, virtual orchestral instruments, or synthesizers. For this game, uh, we've decided it's a sci-fi game. We're probably going to go with synths, and I'm going to go to my go-to synthesizer called Alchemy. Alchemy uh, has a really nice feature uh, uh, that lets you browse by category, and they're descriptors that give you kind of a sense of what the different sounds might sound like. So soundscapes, uh, chaotic, industrial, and uh, distorted. Those are some descriptors that, to me, speak to Quasar League, uh, a battle game in the future. Uh, and uh, in particular, I'm just looking for a, a good instrument to create the base layer that then we'll build on for the subsequent uh, parts of the game. So let's just listen to what we've got here. So it starts out on a default, uh, pretty much just a, a sine wave synth. And let's see what we've got here. Um, Here's one called Contemporary Villain. I like that, but I think that squeal is going to bother some people, so I'll try a couple more here. Maybe not. Uh, how about Crazy Feedback Machine? I like it. So we've got our sound now, and now we have to record it. And uh, I'm actually just recording performance data. This is a MIDI keyboard attached to Logic Pro. I could also uh, use my computer keyboard to type musical notes into, but if you have a MIDI keyboard, it's a nice way to work. So I'm going to make sure my metronome is off. I'm going to hit record. And I'm just going to record some notes that maybe are evocative of the, of the starting of the menu of this game. And I'll stop recording, and let's give that a listen, see if it's what I want. Okay, I think this will work. And now that I've got my first layer, uh, in the next video we're going to explore how we build our layer cake of sounds to uh, convey the progression through the menu and into the gameplay. <laughs>